Ryan Jones here back again with another video and in today's video sorry I haven't been uploading recently Um, I was busy uh, playing football from Wednesday to Friday probably but yeah I'm back with another video Um, and after talking today we're doing something different we're going to be predicting the, the season overall at the, at the end of the season the Premier League Um. Mm, You'll disagree or you'll agree on some of them. Um, like, probably I'll put Wolf, Wolves to finish 12th or something, whatever. Um, but yeah, starting off with Sheffield United, I've obviously put them in 20th. They've had a trash season. Just rather sacked. Um, Paul Hacking bought him in. Uh, Tyndall as assistant manager. They've played so bad. Sheffield, they've played awful. It's 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 worrying. Uh, they're going to be going to the championship. Um, and I don't know how they'll do that. But yeah, that's them in 20th. In 19th, I've gone for... I've gone for Big Sam's, West Brom. They're, they're currently playing Southampton. And it's right now 2-0 West Brom. Um, who scored? Second goal. Jeez, I was right here. But yeah, I think they'll it'll, it'll be it'll be like one point. They just beat Chelsea five two as well, which is a great result for West Brom. Um, but yeah, I just don't think West when um, Big Sam's got enough to do it. They'll go to the championship. I have a feeling they're going to do well in the championship. Um, but yeah, West Brom in nineteenth. Sorry, Big Sam uh, had to do it. Yeah, but in eighteenth, I've gone for Fulham. Uh, I probably would have gone for Newcastle if they wouldn't have beaten Burnley. Um, but yeah, they're too far behind Fulham. I think they're going to get relegated. I think they're going to do well. They've got so many loanies in the club. They've got Ariola, their main choice goalkeeper. They have got uh, Loftus Cheek. They've got Lukman. They've got so many players. But I think 18th, um, I just don't think Scott Parker's got enough enough to do it and uh, they lost to Wolves on Friday night and um, which wasn't the best result for them um but yeah I've put them in 18th uh, in 17th I've actually put uh Newcastle Newcastle United they obviously beat Burnley 2-1 on um Sunday afternoon say Maximan I think he's just a baller and uh, he's a great player for Newcastle he's gonna keep the, he's gonna keep them in the prem um He's a talented player, um, St. Maximan. I think he, they's, Newcastle got enough. I think they got more talent than Fulham. Um, but yeah, in that that's Newcastle on the 17th. In 16th, I put Burnley. Um, obviously, Burnley are right now 15th. Brighton are in 16th. But I think Burnley, they're just... They're all, they're, right now, they're slipping slipping the, the lead. They slipped the 2-0 lead at uh, Southampton and they've done it to Newcastle. Um, think, I think Burnley are going to come in 16th. Uh, I don't think they've got enough to get push up the table. But yeah, uh, that's Burnley in 16th. I've, in 15th, I've put Brighton. They're on a roll this time. They they got unlucky against Manchester United, obviously. Um, but they, they've got a good team. They've got Trussard, who is currently playing well. Mulder, who scored for Switzerland. Um, but Brighton, they, they've got um, Everton tonight, which is a tough game for them. Um, but people say they're going to beat Everton, actually. Um, but yeah, I've put Brighton in 15th. Um, Brighton fans will, will be will be liking me after saying that. Um, in 14th, I put Crystal Palace. Um, they obviously lost 4-1 to... Um, they obviously lost 4-1 to Chelsea on the weekend on Saturday. Um which is not the best from um, from the, uh, Roy Hodgson. But yeah, I, th I just don't think Crystal Palace have got the talent. They've got Bakshuayi, which is not really the best. They've got Saha, which is their best player. Benteke, who is finally scoring. Um, but yeah, Crystal Palace, they're going to be a good team. I know it. Uh, but they're just not, not there anymore. But yeah, in four, 13th, I've got Southampton. Um... They're obviously losing to West Brom, which won't be a good result for them. Um, Southampton, they've got Danny Ings, which looks like he might be going to Man City. I just... Something about Southampton, I just don't think they're going to do well. 
that, um, for the rest of the season, they're just not going to do it. Um, I know Southampton fans might disagree, but I've put Southampton thir 13th. Um, but yeah, in 12th, I've put Wolverhampton Wanderers. Obviously, Raul Jimenez is out. They haven't done the best. I would probably predict them top 10 if Raul Jimenez wasn't injured. But yeah, they they've got my new end of the season, so I hope they lose. Um, but yeah, I think they've they've just I think they're gonna come twelfth. It's just this this feeling. I think they're gonna come twelfth. Um, but yeah, they've got good talent in that squad. They got Dendonka, uh, Semedo, which came from Barca, obviously. But yeah, twelfth for Wolverhampton Wanderers. Eleventh, I've put Aston Villa. Um, they're, they're not they're not do it they lost to Liverpool on the weekend which is predictable um but yeah they've got talent in the team like Ollie Watkins Jack Grealish is injured but Villa are a great team and they're gonna they're gonna push obviously last season they're in a relegation battle just just got out um but yeah Villa in 11th in 10th I've put Arsenal now Leeds hasn't been mentioned yet so they're above Arsenal which is great for them um yeah, I've put Arsenal. They they've got Slavia Prague on Thursday, which is gonna be really tough because Slavia Prague have obviously got the away goal. Uh, they beat Sheffield on the weekend, which is which is obviously what they needed and obviously what was gonna happen. Arsenal, Aubameyang's not up to, not not really doing very well. They just lost. They lost to Liverpool three 0 which was a really poor result. Um. But yeah, Arsenal in tenth. I just think, I just think they're gonna come tenth. It's just my feeling. In ninth, I've got Leeds United. They can. They just beat Man City on the weekend. Stuart Dallas masterclass. Um, I just think Leeds. They've got enough to do it. I think they've got great talent. Rodrigo Rafinha is a beast from the Middle East. Um, I think they they've got good talent. They've got good talent in that team, and I think that's why I put them ninth. In eighth, I put Everton. They they they've got trash home form, but their away form is brilliant. Um, Everton in eighth, I think that's what people would say. I think they just they would just miss out on a uh, Europa League football. But Everton in eighth. Now we're getting down to the Europa League and Champions League. In seventh, I put Spurs. Obviously, they lost to Man U yesterday. Um. Son, you diver, you absolute baby. Um, I don't know why he's doing that. He got obviously he got abuse um online, which shouldn't that shouldn't have happened. Um, but Tottenham, they just it's hard to watch them some days. Sometimes, some days they do the comebacks, some days they don't. Um, but yeah, that's why I put them in seventh. In sixth, I put Chelsea. Obviously, Thomas Tuchel lost to West Brom. He beat Crystal Palace this weekend. Um, mm, I don't know. You know, it's 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 predictable with Chelsea, but yeah, I put them in sixth. I think they'll get Europa League, which is not very good for Thomas Tuchel. But yeah, last Europa League spot I've put, you guessed it, Liverpool. Liverpool in fifth place. Are they they're gonna get Europa League football? Um, they've done they've done they've they've done this good form recently, but they've done it in a bad time. They've got so many good, good teams like West, uh, Leicester and West Ham who are, who obviously if they keep on winning they'll get ahead of Liverpool. And um, but yeah, Liverpool in fifth, in fourth I have put in this Champions League spots, I've put Leicester City. That means West Ham are in the Champions League. Get in, son. Uh, yeah, I've put Leicester. Uh, just because they lost to West Ham on the weekend it wasn't the greatest results. They lost three two. They nearly did the comeback at Dreams. Um, but yeah, Leicester, they're, they're, they're doing good on the Bread and Rogers this season, but less than fourth place for me. In third place, it's West Ham United. Uh, I think they're going to get Champions League. It's Jesse Lingard, the best player in that West Ham team. I hope he come back, come back, comes back to Man U. But West Ham are getting Champions League at the London Stadium. Come on, the boys. And then in second place, I've got Manchester United. They, they've got talent. They're going to stay up there. And obviously, in first, they've got Manchester City. They're going to win the league. They're too good. 
um, they're too good of a team. But yeah, that's my table for the end of the season. So yeah, hope it's you. Please like, subscribe, hit notification bell, so you're not for every type of video. And see you next time. Bye bye.